Amy Robach and TJ, Holmes' fate at GMA3 is still in doubt, as many executives believe they should be fired. The future of TJ, Holmes and Amy Robach at GMA3, what you need to know is unknown. According to a source, ABC is still trying to determine what degree of punishment is justified, if any, as the network investigates the couple's connection. A number of higher-ups at the show believe they should be sacked, says the insider. But they can't fire them, so they're in big problems and trying to figure it out. According to a second source, Holmes, 45, and Robach, 49, believe the situation stinks as they wait over two months for a decision from the network. Previously, a source told people that the co-anchors had not been terminated from the new show, but it was unclear whether they would return to their on-air responsibilities. There is no discussion regarding their future. ABC is wrapping up their probe according to the source. While it is unlikely they would return in the capacity they were in, the longer time passes, the less likely they will return. There are still open lines of contact and additional discussions about what will happen. Despite the ongoing probe, a second source told people that the couple's bond is stronger than ever. They're just going along and doing their thing, the second source said of the couple, who were removed from the air on December 5th. There is no reason to fire them, and they assume they will not be fired. The network is simply waiting for the situation to calm down. This happens all the time in businesses. On Nav, 30 photographs of the TV personalities holding hands in a car during a trip in upstate New York and snuggling up at a bar in New York City prompted dating rumors. Holmes and Roebuck both deleted their Instagram accounts shortly after the photographs were published. Holmes and his wife, Marilee Feebig, have since filed for divorce. Robach and her husband Andrew Shu do not appear to have filed for divorce yet, but according to a source, the couple separated in August. Holmes and Robach have not publicly remarked on their connection, however they referred to it during a December broadcast of GMA3, What You Need to Know. ABC News President Kim Godwin also addressed the news in an email to colleagues in December, stating that the two will stay off-air pending the outcome of an internal assessment, with a rotating cast of anchors filling in. The ongoing coverage of the co-anchors romance, she said, may be distracting from the tremendously important work our team does here at ABC News. I hope that we will continue to concentrate our efforts on what we do best, she added, and I want you all to know how proud I am of your dedication and professionalism.